My name is Todd Marshall. I'm the Robert and Ann Powers Chair in the Humanities at Gonzaga, and from 2016 to 2018, I'm serving as Washington State Poet Laureate. At the end of the second chapter of Walden, Henry David Thoreau writes this often quoted but mysterious passage. Quote, Time is but the stream I go a fishing in. I drink at it, but while I drink I see the sandy bottom and detect how shallow it is. Its thin current slides away, but eternity remains. I would drink deeper, fish in the sky whose bottom is pebbly with stars, I cannot count one. I know not the first letter of the alphabet. I have always been regretting that I was not as wise as the day I was born. When Thoreau confronts the stars and eternity, he loses his ability to count and to communicate. He's taken to a place beyond language, a place of unknowing, of uncertainty, a place closer to the wisdom that came with him into this world, or at least a place where he's more open to a new way of ordering things, a new way of seeing. This feeling Thoreau describes as distant from the arrogance of absolutism and shares a kinship with what I feel at the end of a good discussion about the arts, or after a few hours sitting around a table talking poetry with students, both here at Gonzaga and with the many lifelong students I meet out in the communities of Washington. It's what's in the air at the end of a compelling reading of poems, that moment before people clap, when something, let's call it the possibility of seeing ourselves anew, hangs in the air. The humanities, the arts, poetry, do not fit into equations, but I believe that they are valuable perhaps even necessary during times of disagreement and conflict. Mm -hmm.